virus, which has been a big part of our lives this year, is also leading to changes as families look to celebrate the holidays. Several celebrations are kicking off tonight, but all are making efforts to keep people safe. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez live at Discovery Green, where the ice rink opens up today. Kathy, good morning. Well, good morning to you. Families can still get excited. Despite the pandemic, two of Houston's biggest holiday events will be back, but with some changes, of course. Two of Houston's biggest holiday events will look a lot different this year. The ice rink will open at 5 this evening as the first big event at Discovery Green since the pandemic began. It'll be limited to 50% capacity. People must buy tickets online in advance and everyone will be required to wear masks. They've also made changes to ensure social distancing when people change their shoes and skates. When you come out here, it's like everywhere. I mean, everywhere. They got them on the trees, the stands, the food, everything. Another big holiday favorite, Zoo Lights, welcomes families tomorrow. Some members already got a sneak peek. I thought it was really fun just to see all the lights light up in the, with the music, and I thought it was pretty cool. All guests older than 10 are required to wear face coverings, and tickets must be bought online. People will have time tickets to allow for social distancing inside the zoo. And nothing can stop a special holiday tradition. Children will still be allowed to take a picture with Santa with social distance, of course. They've got hand sanitizer everywhere. Pretty much everybody's wearing a mask unless they're eating. So I feel pretty safe about coming out. You can see here Discovery Green crews are preparing the ice rink for the big grand opening tonight. Staff also say they will be cleaning and disinfecting areas frequently for information on how to visit both events. Just go to our website, click to Houston.com. Happy holidays. Reporting live in downtown Houston, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC Channel 2 News. All right, Kathy.